Um, this is a demonstration of Concerto running on a Raspberry Pi. Um, that's a picture of a Raspberry Pi, that's not actual scale, that's um, a picture. It's actually credit card size, it costs about £30 or $35 if you're in the States, um, and is a low cost uh, Linux computer. Um, Concerto, on the other hand, is an open source digital signage display system. Um, there's a very active Google group. If you look for Concerto Digital Signage, um, you'll find a lot of helpful advice in there, and uh, a lot of the developers are active in that group. Um, so, this display is a Raspberry Pi. It's running the Debian Wheezy distribution straight off the uh, Raspberry Pi Foundation website. Runs LXDE as its uh, GUI interface, and the Midori browser is auto started um, to display the Concerto server um, images. Uh, again, details of this are in the Raspberry Pi thread on the Google group Concerto Digital Signage. Um, so let me reboot it um, so you can see how quickly it starts up, or not, as the case may be. So this is the Raspberry Pi starting up, that's its normal screen. Um, quite a lot of Linuxy bits coming up here. Um, as I say, this is basically a free digital signage system on a low cost computer running on any, any HDMI um, TV. Uh, the Raspberry Pi has an HDMI output, uh, also has a standard composite video output so you can plug it into older television sets if you need to. Um, comes with 256 meg of memory, uh, an ethernet port so you can plug it into the network that's how this is working and an SD card slot which is where it gets all its software from um, to start the system. That's the Raspberry Pi logo which comes with the distribution so that you, there you see LXDE just before it starts Midori the Dory browser then starts up automatically, goes to full screen, and starts displaying the Concerto signage. So there's the template. The first thing that comes up is system date and time. Again, that's fed off the server. Um, and then uh, the first pieces of information that come out. Um, this particular template, there are various templates available. This particular template has a date and time, a ticker field here, HTML page here, and an image page here. Um, there are, I say, various types and colours, and you can create your own. Um, what's unusual about this is this is also running um, against a Raspberry Pi that's running as the Concerto server itself. So that's a standard LAMP installation, that is a Linux implementation with an Apache web server. MySQL database server and PHP programming system. Um, that Raspberry Pi is running about four screens at the moment, including this one, um, including an iPad, a netbook with Chrome browser, and my standard desktop machine with another browser in, uh, running the digital signage. And it's running at about 10 to 30 percent of its CPU load as a server running four screens. Um, there are Windows screen savers available um, and there are Mac screen savers available and there's also an Android application in beta if you really want to um, get digital signage onto your phones. Um, so there we are, Concerto running on a Raspberry Pi. Um, reasonably okay as far as it goes but apparently the transitions that are going between the images, um, there are supposed to be fades in and out of the of the different images. But on this browser and this Raspberry Pi, they don't work. Um, not sure where that issue is, but there we are. So there you go. Enjoy. All the details are available on the Google Group Concerto Digital Signage in the Raspberry Pi thread. Thank you for watching.